Hello everybody. Long time no see. So I will make a short uh, summary of what is happening now at the 10 and 6 day race in Flushing, New York. Self Transcendence, Switch and Moist 6 and 10 day race. Uh, so uh, now it's uh, 8 10 uh, in the morning. In a little less than four hours, uh, the day number four will end and the six day runners will start. So, uh, right now it's a beautiful weather, as you can see, it's uh, full spring. Like right now, it's 11 degrees Celsius and will be plus 20 and the only rain they will face uh, probably Sunday, that's it. Uh, but they are facing <laughs> different challenges, other challenges like dancing, party and barbecue directly on the course. <laughs> Yesterday, it was unexpected. Anyway, uh, Butcher Golf from Mongolia leading the uh, men's 10-day race. He did about 100 miles first day, 90 miles second day, and now, uh, like, he's pretty good, not that fast pace, but good pace, and um, he's sleeping also not so long, so he maintains this uh, gap between him and second runner, uh, about 30 miles constantly maintains and I think it will be till the end. Andrea and uh, the Taiwanese runner, uh, they are all, always like interchanging the positions. Uh, Andrea uh, adopted the format uh, from 3100 miles, so he sleeps during the night, probably five, even six hours, and then during the days uh, he moves continuously, doing stretching, everything on the go. Uh, still, pretty good. And uh, first uh, among the women is a Taiwanese uh, girl, Venya. Uh, very determined, very light and uh, also constant pace. Um, the second is uh, Justiene from Brazil and she is always smiling, very nice uh, energy and yeah just just good experience for her. I was a little bit worried because I saw uh, like five or seven pairs of uh, sandals uh, which she was about to run all the race but thanks God she switched to uh, shoes running shoes uh, because yeah sandals could be a little tough uh, less cushioning and definitely a little colder during the night anyway uh, there is a new lab because uh, the old uh, place uh, where the camp was previous years, all the previous years, uh, is under construction. They were doing some landscaping and re park reconstruction. So there is a new lab, and uh, and it's uh, 1.2 k, pretty smooth, no sharp edges, uh, pretty flat. So many runners like it even more than previous and and definitely the new camp place also very nice so together with Sanjay we are doing breakfasts for runners and to deliver breakfast by 6 a.m. we need to start about 4 a.m. but nothing is impossible so you train a lot yes I train in Canberra oh in Canberra yeah you mean with peace run? Uh, yes. Uh -huh. <laughs> it was nice experience. 
Uh -huh. And he also, I'm feeling better than the last year. Uh -huh. But I, I see you always smiling. Ah, oh, but this is part of the race. <laughs> oh, this is part of protocol. <laughs> yes. You, need, without... you, just, you just need to smile to survive. Exactly. <laughs> so you don't have any injuries? No. All good? All good. <laughs> I was a little worried when I saw all your uh, sandals and, oh. and no shoes. Yes. But now, look at these. Well, uh, yes, yes. <laughs> I start with uh, sandals and uh, has given me a good style and uh, I change for shoes and I continue with the same. Yeah, for sandals I think it's a little cold. Yes, yes, a little cold. Yeah, but I'm happy. Yeah, yeah <laughs> we can see. We can see. Good luck, Jessiana. Thank good luck. you. Bye. <laughs> yeah, she's not cold. <laughs> cool. Andrea is always moving in a good style like in 3100 <laughs> stretching on the go yes, yes how do you feel after four days it's <clears throat> end of the four, four, day number four yes I, I have to be sincere i thought it was a little bit easier yeah. <laughs> somehow it looks like it's a little bit tough race but you just finished six day race in italy yeah that's true uh, i think you <laughs> not fully recovered yeah but yeah. you cannot resist running your own country exactly, right exactly <laughs> No, I. Yeah, I was happy. That that was my first race, my first multi-day race in Italy. Uh -huh. I did it uh, one month ago, uh -huh. and uh, I was happy to be there. And I'm also happy to be here in New York. It's a, it's a very big privilege. So. But I I think still you will do like good miles ahead of you. Yeah, let's see. <clears throat> the important thing is to to be steady. You know, to have. A daily goal, uh -huh. a daily millage that you have to to reach. What is your daily goal? Yeah, normally I, I like the 70 miles. 70, so right. I 70 hope at the end. I, yeah, I hope at the end I will do more than 700. Uh -huh. uh, but you never know. Let, let's see how it evolves. Uh -huh. the race. Do you compete with the uh, goal? No, no. I have to say, yeah. Uh, the Mongolian uh, uh, guy is uh, it's really another level. It's uh, Bujagal. 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 Yes. Uh, he's another level. He, I, I guess he turned professional in a way that he doesn't work. But most of us, we are we are amateur, so we race, of course, and it's our passion. But then and then we sleep uh, and then no, we work. <laughs> no, exactly. No, I mean, I mean when we go back to. To our countries we yeah. have a regular job so yeah. but i guess he, he turned completely professional so uh -huh. he he can face the race with different attitudes somehow uh, he can train more specifically and rest more and so on but anyway i really i really admire what he did along the years uh -huh. how he evolved as a runner he did really really uh, nice steps so I guess he is out of question for most of us. Uh, he definitely is going to win the race. Uh, I realize that if you want really to to make a step to become better, then you have to learn the art of sleep deprivation. Uh -huh. <laughs> That's the secret yeah. to make the yeah. to bring the whole game to the next level. Somehow. So if some runners are very strong, they can do with three hours sleep uh -huh. per night instead of six. Uh -huh. Then of course they advantage. Yeah, they, they have more mind. Not yeah. because they are necessarily faster than me, yeah. but because they are they stay on the course more time. Right. right. So. Okay, Andrea. Good luck. We'll see you again. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Keep good job. Alakananda doing uh, pictures for the race. She's official photographer, so you can follow the. Uh, history of the race in pictures following the link in the description. Uh, see you soon!